Cikgu Dila and today I will teach about da 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 Hmm, there's a lot of animals. So, our topic today is animals. So, this is Science Year 1 topic. But, before that, don't forget to like and subscribe my videos. Let's move. Today, we will talk about the body parts of animals. So, let's see. Heck, body. <gasps> What's the animal? Tail. Okay. There's a lot of animals that have head, body, and also a tail. Ah, so let's see. This is a horse. So, which one is the head? Yes, that is the head of the horse. That is the body and that is the tail. Any body parts that I don't see? Uh, oh, it have a leg, it have eyes, it have ears. Okay, next. The body part of animals. Oh, these animals have a horn. Okay, it's a rhinoceros. So, the all other body parts also have uh, at a horse, legs, body, head, with the special for rhinoceros, it have a horns. Mm, okay, so it have horns. That is rhinoceros. Any animals that have horns? Mm, can you name one? Write at the comment, please. <laughs> ah. We have two other animals here. So let's identify the other body parts. So this is a deer and good. Okay. There's also the other two animals that have horns. Ah, they have horns. So where's the horns? That is the horns. Besides, both of these animals also have fine hair. So fine hair, it's almost like a fur, but it's very fine and tiny one. That's a fine hair, it's not like a fur. Next, so what the horns is? So what's the importance of the horns for this kind of animals? The horns help the animals to protect themselves from enemies. Next, the body parts of animal. Oh, the previous one we have horn, but this one has tusk. So which animal have a tusk? Can't you guess? Yes, that is an elephant. Elephant is one of the animals that have tusk and also a trunk. So what is the trunk? Okay, so that is the tusk and the long one is the trunk the trunk used by elephants to water and then <laughs> then it will show a rainbow maybe so next hmm what kind of animal oh this animal have a beak do you know what is beak ah so here we have an eagle these animals also have wings and feather. Ah, it also have a sharp claws. Let's look where is the beak, the claws, the wings, and the feathers. So, that is the beak. The mouth of these animals have a beak. Okay, and then that is the claws. Uh, okay, sharp claws. So what is the use for the sharp claws? Cut, to catch enemies. So it can find food to catch enemies by using their sharp claws. These animals also have wings. Okay, the left and right also the wings. The wings for this eagle. Any other birds also have wings. And these animals have a feather. 
So the wings help the animals to fly. <laughs> Next, we move to the body parts of animals. Ah, this is a special one. We have a snail. What's so special about snail? Shell. Let's see. The toys. Ah. So the special of a snail and the tortoise. Tortoise. Sorry. Tortoise. Both of these animals have a shell. The shell is seems like the house for these animals. So that means these animals carry their house everywhere. Everywhere they go. Carry at the back. Whenever they whenever there is an enemy come next to them, they just go inside their, their shell. Hiding inside their shell. And then the shell protects them from enemies so the shell is to protect themselves from enemies do we have house yes we do have a house so our house also to protect us from the rain from the hot weather Man. body parts of animals ah hard skins do you know any animals that have a hard skin and I show one example which is crocodile. Crocodile have very hard skin. It's not like our skin. Our skin is soft. But the crocodile have a hard skin. So let's see. This is the picture of a crocodile. Look at the skin. How is it look like? Mm, that's hard skin. So that is the hard skin. And one more thing, crocodiles have a webbed, webbed feet. <laughs> ah, so the hard skin is for self protection, and the webbed feet is to help the animals to swim. Okay. Next, we have the body parts of animals. This one is a butterfly. So, what's special about butterfly? Butterfly, butterfly <laughs> have antenna. So, <laughs> this is a butterfly. That is the antenna. Any other animals that have antenna? Ah, write at the comment, please. And it's also have a Wings. So, what is the use for wings? Wings use for the animals to fly. Next, so, <laughs> yes, the wings help the animals to fly. And the antenna is enable the insect to feel or taste, smell the food. Okay, either food or anything around them. So, that is the functions of antenna. They enable the insect to feel, taste or smell because this insect don't have no stairs mm. so they have antenna and oh is that a fish so what's so special about fish what is the body parts of fish don't have at any other animals let's see so the special of fish fish have a fin where is the fin Ah, that is the fin for a fish. Most fish have a fin. Almost all the fish have a fin. So what is the function of fin? Oh, well, fish also have a scale. Next. Oh. So, let's move to the back. But before that, about the fin. Fin helps fish to swim better. Next, we move to the next part of body which is bad okay bad oh. we have a porcupine mm, this one we need to identify the body parts of this animal we have a porcupine porcupine special one porcupine have a sharp needles around their bodies I'm going too fast and end Let's identify the similar body parts of the animals below. So we have ant, we have a cockroach, we have 
a grasshopper. So if you can see here, what is the similar part of these three animals? Both animals have, uh, not both, we have three animals here. So these three animals have legs. But only two animals can fly. But the similar things, the other similar things about these animals is leg, eyes, oh, the antenna. All these three animals have antenna. This is animals. All of these three is insect. Okay, they have antenna. Next, we have elephant. We have cow. Identify the similar body parts of the animals. Huh. These two animals both have leg, both have tail, both have ears. That's it. Any animals? Write at the comment. Next. Oh, we have a dolphin. We have a whale. So, identify the similar body parts of the animals below. So both of these animals have a fin. Remember, both are fish and they have fin. That's right. Next, we have a stingray, we have a shark, and a fish. Hmm, what is similar body parts of these animals? They have all of these three have mouths, have eyes, but hmm, oh. They all have a tail and fin. Ah, this is almost at the end of this slide. So the first one, what is the first one? So this one, we need to identify the body parts for the animals below. So the first one is big. Yes, that's true. The second one is scale. That one is fin. Head, the body, that one, number six, is tail, that one is the wing, and number eight, ah, number eight is a horn or tusk, remember, ah, this one is a horn, and the last one is a The last one is a, what is it? Ah, the last one is a, also a horn. Next, number one. Number one is shell. Number two is antenna. Number three is heart skin. Ha, ah, hard skin. Number four is fine hair. Number five is feather. And the last one, rabbit feet. Okay. I think that's it. Thank you for listening. But don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye.